Okay, today we're going to take a look at this Royal Purple oil filter number 20-500 and this Open Purulator Boss oil filter from a past video number 22500. And you can get this Royal Purple oil filter at O'Reilly Auto Parts for $16.99 and you can get this Purulator Boss oil filter at Advanced Auto Parts for $15.79. But I got these filters for free. Yep, a generous viewer whose name is John Parada from Yonkers, New York sent me these oil filters. Thanks, John. And these filters fit his 2018 Chevy Impala. Yep, the one with the 3.6 liter V6 engine. And these two are going to duke it out. Could get ugly, folks. And when the dust clears, we'll see who the winner is. So let's get started. This is a network. You got a really good silicone, a nice pipe. Get your inner here. Filtration. Okay, let's start with the Royal Purple. We'll start with the box. 100% synthetic microglass media, 99% filtration efficiency. And if you check out Royal Purple's website, that's at 25 microns. Silicone anti drain back valve. Extra heavy duty rubber base gasket. And if we look over here, we'll see manufactured by Champion Laboratories. Okay, let's open her up and see what she looks like. Date code 012022AF, product of USA. And this is all a sticker right here, big sticker. Royal purple sticker. Metal core louvers, looks to be a bypass valve down below. Six inlet holes. And there's a lot of grooves there, a lot of threads. And this is the extra heavy duty base gasket. Pretty thick. Comes off fairly easy though. And if you look up the filter for uh, John's car, this number won't come up. You'll get a number 20 163. I'll put a picture up, up, up above. Um, he uses this filter though because it's slightly larger and it fits his vehicle. Okay, so let's look at the Pure Later. Pure Later has been open already from a past video. So we're just going to check out the box. Okay, on the front here, they'll say 20,000 miles. Up to 20,000 miles. On the side, it says 15,000 miles. They need to fix their box, I guess. <laughs> but it also has 99%. And they got a plus, plus efficiency. And that's also at 25 microns. And this is, they got the Smart Fusion uh, Synthetic, which is a polymer backing. Okay, so I say we uh, open up this Royal Purple and take a look at these guys and see what they look like. Be right back. Okay, let's get their weights and let's start with the Royal Purple. 372 grams. Pure Later Boss. 337 grams and how about the base plates royal purple 160 grams pure later boss 182 grams Let's look at these guys up close the threads look pretty equal boss has more inlet holes How about the, let's look at the gaskets. Okay, we got the Royal Purple on my right, Pure Later Boss on the left. Uh, looks like the Royal Purple looks a little thicker. Maybe not though, it could be just deceiving there. I'll have to measure them later. I can measure them right now. There's a royal purple. 7.44 millimeters. That's a little narrower. 6.41 millimeters for the Pure Later Boss. But both base plates are nice base plates. And 
Both got silicone anti drain back valves. Of course, the royal purple has got to be a purple color. <laughs> Let's see how they fit. Yeah, it fits nicely over the, the holes. The Purely Boss and the Royal Purple. Also, same thing. Yeah, they fit nice. Okay, the filter element. Royal Purple. Iron 5 grams. Okay, and the purely boss is all apart here, but same thing, 85 grams. We'll get that in a second. And, okay, the royal purple, it's got this combo valve, which weighs 10 grams. And the purely boss got this stamp leaf spring that weighs 8 grams. Now let's check out the cans while we're at it. Royal Purple weighs 92 grams. Pure Later Boss weighs 58 grams, quite a bit lighter. And that's because the Royal Purple is pretty thick. Get a thickness here. I was getting about 0 0.5, 0 0.51, 0 0.549. 0 0.49, yeah, well that's still pretty thick. Usually 0 0.4 to 0.5 is about average. 0.36 for the Royal uh, Pure Later Boss. So, yeah, it's definitely thinner. You can feel it too. Okay. So, I counted 36 pleats on the Royal Purple. Here's the seam, crimp seam. A lot of excess glue here though, look at that. And metal end caps. But right there's some excess glue. Yeah, quite a bit of excess glue there. The Royal Purple, it's got a micron rating of 99% at 25 microns. And it's a full synthetic, and they call it a micro glass media. Yeah, it all looks nice except for, well, that. That's, that's, a, that's a slobber monster there. Wow. Look at that. These, are, these ain't cheap filters that either. And, you know, I'm going to put a little clip of video up, up in here right now and show you guys this part of it. So, I'll go to that clip. And the Pure Later Boss. Metal end caps, a little sloppy with the glue. Metal crimp seam, and it counted 49 pleats. And this is a full synthetic media with a micron rating of 99% at 25 microns. The pure later is 2.70 inches wide. Okay, so let's get the measurement on the Royal Purple. The width is 2.76 inches wide. And you saw the width on the Pure Later Boss. It was 2.70 inches wide. Okay, so let's uh, get a size difference here. We got... Pure Later Boss, which has more pleats, but it's narrower. And we got the Royal Purple, which is wider, but less pleats. I'm going to say, though, that the Royal Purple is shorter. It's got less filter media. What do you guys think? Well, let's cut these guys open and uh, stretch them out see how long they are. Be right back. Okay, here they are stretched out, and the Pure Later Boss is 39 inches long, 
and the royal purple is 31 and a half inches long okay here they are at the seams and let's get their thickness this is the royal purple 0.76 millimeters and pure later boss point eight one millimeters a little bit thicker and I managed to get it away from this plastic screen backing I couldn't do it last time I tried it but I got got it this time let's look at these guys up close you know they're like dual layered they got more than one layer on these things there's like a little scrim right here for the royal purple and the pure later pure later boss is just it's pretty thick and strong but it's like a dual layer see that this doesn't tear that easy yeah I mean it'll tear but it's pretty pretty tough stuff whereas this royal purple will tear easily but you know that's why it's got this metal screen backing so the Royal Purple's got the metal screen backing, and the Pure Later Boss got the plastic screen backing, which I think they call this a polymer. But both are strong. These things, these things are strong. You know, it's this kind of wire backing too that it bends, see, and it holds its shape once you bend it. So, less uh, filter media on the Royal Purple. So let's look at the rest of the filter. And I forgot to mention this earlier. This uh, Pure Later Boss on my left is, this is acrylic, ethylene acrylic, ethylene acrylic gasket. It's not a nitro rubber gasket. The Royal Purple is a nitro rubber gasket. You can tell they look, they look different also. See like how shiny it is? It's almost like a plasticky kind of feel to it. So yeah, I forgot to mention that earlier. Okay, and how about the rest of this? Okay, we got the... They both got stamp leaf spring separators. We got the combo valve. We got the valve down here. So that's a matter of preference. Both got louvers. The base plates, I would have to give... I have to give it to the boss because uh more inlet holes. The threads are pretty equal. And they both got silicone and drain back valves, so that's good. Royal Purple's got a thicker can. And this is also a sticker too, I forgot to mention that. Both got stickers. And the price is pretty similar, so which one would you guys use? Well, again, I want to thank John for sending me these oil filters. Thanks, John. And I think I'll wrap this video up. And don't forget, Oil Filter Friday. I open up a new automotive oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching, and take care. The Pure Later Boss with the plastic screen backing weighs 21 grams. The Royal Purple with the metal screen backing weighs 27 grams.